Coach, any update on Tyler Fortberry? He's not with our program anymore. Um, you know, I think he felt like um, he wasn't going to have the role that he felt like you needed to have, and so he made the decision to um, to go home. And we wish him the best, but um, would have loved to have seen him sticking out and compete, but it just wasn't uh, wasn't in the cards for him. Darian Wiley, full speed today, back. He's he's working his way back. You know, this was his first practice back, so um, with the soft tissue stuff, and he's had issue early in camp with just. Um, some of the heat exposure stuff, so we're going to be cautious with them, but it was good to see him back out there. What do you made of Diego Pavia's mental leadership throughout camp? Uh, you know, he's been steady. I mean, I think um, um, I, I, I need his personality to infuse into our team, you know, and I, I think he's working on that. It takes time to build relationships, but he is very consistent and um, he's very driven, and he's got clear goals for himself and clear goals for the team, and um, yeah, I, I respect that. So um, I'm excited to see him continue to, to grow in that way, and, and the team needs him to. Um, what happened with Chase Mitchell there? Just a stinger. Um, so it's, uh, you know, kind of normal. Um, you know, in football, you, you get those stingers. Sometimes they kind of get into your trap. They get a little uncomfortable and just take some time to get past. It looked like he was able to get, get his pads back on. And, I'm not sure what, whether or not he got back into the game, but um, yeah, he'll be all right. What do you think of Luke Fungi's personality and kind of the way he's gotten here? Loic's been a welcome addition. I mean, he's a tough, tough, consistent um, playmaker who, um, you know, has, has challenged us defensively, and um, I got a ton of respect for him. Glad he's here. Um, looking for him to have a great finish to his, his, uh, his career here. How close are you guys? Well, I think we're pretty close, and not that that can't change. Um, you know, I think it's five plus anymore. You know, so you're, you're looking at how many guys are, are playable or over the line, and so um, you know whether that's seven or eight, or if that's six that grows to seven. You know, as the season goes on, so you always you always going to you're going to give room for guys to to cross that line as they go. But I think we're close to identifying who those playable guys are right now, and, and focusing reps on them. What have you seen out of Dante Carter and how has he sort of adjusted to Vanderbilt football? Um, Dante has got elite playmaking ability and really good instinct and feel. Um, he, um, I think like any freshman, he's, he's dealt with the highs and lows of, of learning a playbook and the grind of college football. You know, I mean, it's totally different. Uh, he was able to kind of push through some of that in the winter and spring, which was great to have him here. He's added weight to his frame. Now sustaining that weight, it will be the challenge through the season. Uh, but um, he's, you know, he, he's a guy that that is going to have a role for us, and I think he's still defining what that role will be. Uh, but uh, safety is a hard position now. I mean, you 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 have to you quarterback the defense from back there. And um, again, I think he should be really proud of himself for the progress he's made. But I know he wants more, and we're going to push him to more. Obviously, you started off a little short-handed at corner. What have you kind of made of guys emerging in the absence of Marlon Jones and Mark Davis? Yeah, um, I mean, I think, you know, we've seen the, the returning guys, Martell, Trudell, obviously Tyson, um, you know, be steady. Taco's been consistent out here. Um, obviously, um, KT, you know, just, uh, you know, has been elite at times. I think he's still, he's still fine-tuning his process. Um, and then, um, you know, Jalen Lackey's been a, been a great, um, a great uh, surprise, not a surprise, but, you know, he's made great strides. I think he's further along than maybe we anticipated, and we saw that kind of starting in the summer. Um, he's, he's confirmed it out here as a playmaker, um, and uh, we'll, we'll look forward to him having a role too.